Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm here to do my 100 Lico challenge. And today we have Lico 409, longest palindrome. Given a string S, which consists of lowercase or uppercase letters, we turn the link of the longest palindrome that can be built with those letters. Um, what that means is now we have string, uh, input string right here, a, B, C, 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 D, D. Um, you can use any character and in any order, then build another palindrome. And the palindrome that can be built using this uh, character, which is uh, D, C, C, A, C, C, D, is one of the palindrome. So the length of this palindrome is the longest one, which is seven. Uh, we just output seven. In this case, um, we can see, you can imagine a, whenever they have double CC in here, so it's a pair, we can keep that pair somewhere because in this pair, you can just put the um, extra one in the middle. It's always correct. In this pair, you can put another pair inside. So it's still a palindrome. Uh, so this is three pairs. And you can put one B in the middle of this all the pairs, which is, yeah, you see the CC is right here and CC is right here and these outside. So the pair we build up from the left and right and you can put one extra character in the between. Then you can get the total length of three pair is three times two, which is six plus one extra one. So the idea is like that. And we can first have a set. Uh, we will use a set of character. Equal to new uh, has set. Now you have a has set and then we need to look through every character in S dot to character array. So we'll look through every character in this string. If we don't see that if set contain C. So that means if there's a C inside this set, then what we can do is we found a pair and we can have pair started with zero. We have zero pair now. Now we put something in the set and the second time we see that in the set, we found a pairs. So pair will equal to pairs plus one. Now we remove that from the set. Yeah, and we remove that from the set and then we we have one pairs in here already. If the set doesn't have that pair, we'll, and then set will add C inside the set. And after you look through the whole entire array, you will capture how many pairs in this array. I mean, in this string. And if they have any single one, they will be captured in the set. So what we can do is pair equal to pairs time two. So now you have how many individual character. And if there's additional, um, if additional character in the set, that's not cancel out. It is empty and talk and type in the same time, really bad. So if set is not empty, that we have some individual one, then pair should add one. Because if you have all the pairs, you can put uh, an additional one character inside that um, pair in the between of the pairs. So now you have pair time two plus additional one, then you have 
that you have pairs equal to all the longest palindrome that you can build with this character. And you return pairs. That should be it. Hopefully it's worked. Cool, uh, that's it for this question. If you have any question, please comment it below and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.